Hi, I'm Nico de Swert. I'm a floral designer and interior stylist, and I would love to show you some easy florals for your home. The first one is this beautiful, simple grid that you can create with the Bosphorus Square vase. They're uh, the small, smallest bud vase. You just place them on a coffee table or on your dining table and kind of create a grid. I did here uh, nine of them. Four of them I put candles in. The other ones you just simply uh, take whatever you can find, uh, whatever your budget can allow. In this case, I have some variegated leaves that I'm just putting inside of the bud vase and just a flower head that goes with it. And there you go, just very simple and easy, but it makes such a great statement on your coffee table and it's gonna impress your guests. The second one I'm doing is a beautiful centerpiece, also could be on a coffee table or a centerpiece for your dining room table. Usually I love to do this when I have guests over, just pull out uh, the largest Bosphorus bowl, put some seeded yuke on the bottom, pour in some little water and add some rose heads to it in the middle of the candle, just lit it and it's just beautiful and very simple and it's not gonna break the bank. The third thing that we're doing is in this gorgeous voluminous canister from Pottery Barn and I'm basically creating a small little terrarium inside of it. Very simple again, I use two hydrangea heads um, that I cut out of the garden and just placed them on the bottom, added a little bit of water and then I have these uh, tiny little green uh, button, uh, buttons, what they call them, they're uh, small green chrysanthemums, very strong and very inexpensive. You just place a little cluster here and a little cluster on the other side and then the last ingredient that we're going to add is these uh, Galex leaves. Um, you basically are going to roll them up just like that into a little cone, take the floral stapler and just staple the leaf together and then create a little bundle just like that. And we're also gonna place that inside of the canister. And it adds another texture and another color to it. And that's pretty much it. It's just very simple. You can put the lid on it and just put this on your coffee table again or on your dining room table. Our next arrangement is a very tiny arrangement in this small bud face from the Square Collection from Pottery Barn. Uh, what I did basically is I, have, I had all these grasses, so I chopped them down into small little pieces, and I'm using that as a flower frog. So you just fill your container with all the snippets of the grass, and then the heads of the grass you just also place in there. And then we have two uh, sunflower heads that I took off the small yellow uh, petals because they were already starting to wilt. And we're just gonna put two into, into the arrangement. We're just gonna add some few more grasses to it, just one here. And there you go, a very simple, easy fall arrangement. The last arrangement that we're gonna make is in the largest Bosphorus vase from Pottery Barn, and it's the really the easiest and simple arrangement. Um, sometimes you buy a Phalaenopsis orchid and you come home and the branch is broken and you don't wanna throw out those beautiful, gorgeous blooms. So a really easy solution for that is to create an arrangement just like that. And what I've used is these pliable, very loose aluminum wire uh, that you can get from any florist supply store. And you basically just uh, take it apart like that and you just place it on your counter or on your table that you're working on. And then you take the individual uh, orchid blooms and you just attach them with uh, thin floral wire in the same color as the uh, aluminum wire and just cut off a little piece and you just attach the bloom to the wire. So you continue doing this and then in the end you just fill up the vase with water and submerge the wire just straight into the vase like that and it's just finished. Very simple, beautiful and such a statement.